Hmm, what are you going to wear today, Sandy? Hmm, maybe the long blonde one or the red one? No, I like this one. Hmm, maybe this one? No. Well, ah, wait a minute, Sandy, you wore this one yesterday. Hmm, no, get something else. Well, no, ah, I already looked at that one. Hmm. Are you going to wear it again? Yeah, why not? It's your favorite. Hey y'all, welcome to wigs.com. I'm Sandy, also known as Ivy Wiggin. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my top five favorite wigs. I think that if my wigs could talk, they would look at me and say, pick me, pick me. Why won't you pick me? Because I seem to choose the same ones over and over again. And I feel like it's the same with my clothing. You know, you have clothes that have sat in your closet for a long time, but you choose that shirt that is really comfortable. You choose that pair of jeans that make you feel extra skinny. That pair of shoes that are so adorable, that are so cute when you wear them out, that everybody stops you and say, I love your shoes, I love your shoes. And it's the same way with my wigs. It's the ones that when people stop me, they say, I love your hair, I love your hair. <laughs> There's so many reasons why I choose wigs as my favorite. And today I'm gonna to show you what those five wigs are. Now the first one that we're gonna look at is On Point. This has been a favorite bestseller for Raquel Welch for a long time. And right off, you can probably see why. It is this really pretty classic bob that hugs at the nape, has a sharp line towards the front and just rest here at the clavicle bone. It is sleek, it's straight, it's easy to maintain. You can take your heating tool up to 300 degrees and go through this wig and it's ready to wear it the next time. It is a really easy put on and go out the door and where it's um, off the shoulder at the neck, then it's really good for summertime and it doesn't create that friction on these heat friendly fibers. It is a wig that I choose over and over again just because it's simple to wear. It's classic. It's one of my favorite styles ever and um, it is really has been a favorite of mine for a long time. So let's look at on point on all sides and then we'll talk about the shade and the cap construction on on point. So you're going to see this shade uh, repeat. <laughs> on most of the ones that I'm going to show you today and for that I apologize <laughs> but it's the shade that I always go to with Raquel Welch uh, it's my favorite blonde it's their RL 20 RL 19 23 SS and that is shaded biscuit it is a cool ash blonde that is highlighted heavily with a platinum blonde and then you have a dark root it's just a really pretty blended shade that is bright and I just love the shade and I choose it over and over and over again. <laughs> so let's look at the cap. Now this is a center mono, meaning it's a fixed part in the center, but you can slightly move the cap over uh, if you want a little bit of an off-center part. On Point has an extended lace front the felt covered ear tabs with metal stays and this is Raquel Welch's memory 3 cap which has the silicone on the strips on the open wefts and it just forms to your head it creates a memory over time and then you have the extended nape that is felt covered velour covered I don't know everybody says it differently and then you have the velcro strap adjusters so let's take a look one more time at on point and there's a ton of shades in Raquel Welch's on point this is a heat friendly fiber 
So you can use your heating tool on it. Grab my comb. I like to do this with most of my bobs, y'all. Tuck it behind the ear. It's just a really cute look. You can add accessories to on point. But I think it's really cute just all on its own. Okay, so let's take a look at Sandy's next favorite wig. <laughs> Total transformation, right? Isn't that the fun thing about wigs is you can change your look and go from a totally different look in just a matter of seconds. Okay, so this is Wavy Day, one of my favorites. Uh, do we see a trend here? <laughs> It's because I wear this wig a lot. I've had this wig probably a couple of summers and it is mainly a summer go-to. I always choose this one in the summer. I don't know why. There's just certain wigs that I choose in the summer and those that I choose in the fall. I'll change the shades, the lengths, but this is my summer go-to wavy day. I get so many compliments on it. It is an all over one length bob that has this side swept bang and it is just that beach way that we've seen trending for a long time. Just looks really natural, like you've been in, at the beach and your hair is just naturally air dried. It's a really easy to put on and go wig. And I have not had to do a lot with this wig. Maybe just go over the ends just slightly on wavy day with some heat and it has held up really well and that's why certain wigs I choose as a favorite if they have a longevity to them for me so this is shaded biscuit we're gonna see shaded biscuit on almost all of them <laughs> sorry maybe if I do this in the fall there will be different shades let's take a look at wavy day all the way around We'll look inside of the cap. Okay, so one of my favorite features on a wig always is when it has a full monofilament top, meaning that you can change the direction of the part um, in any direction. And then you have the, um, yep, yeah, it's ear tab to ear tab on this lace. And it has the uh, memory 3 cap, the silicone on the wefts, and you have the extended nape that is felt covered and the Velcro strap adjusters. This cap is very roomy. Uh, so I'm a 22 half, 22 and a half circumference and I have to move those adjusters in and I think I'm going to move them in just a little bit y'all because I just washed this wig and I don't know if they come loose or not, but okay much better feels much better there you have it wavy day by raquel welch no this is not wavy day again <laughs> looks a lot like it doesn't it this is simmer elite um, y'all when i say that i've had this wig forever I really, really have. It's been at least three years that I've had Simmerlite, and it looks pretty much the same as it did when I first got it. Um, it is going to appear a little shorter on me. This is a fully hand-tied cap, and we're going to look at that, but it, it fits me a little snugger on my 22 and a half circumference, so most of the time, when you see Simmerlite, it'll rest on a lot of people's shoulders. It sits a little higher on me right above my collarbone, and that's because of that fully hand-tied cap. Simmer is also available in the uh, standard uh, cap, so this is the cream of the crop. This is, they have just taken Simmer and given it an upgrade on that fully hand-tied cap. You have the all-over one-length bob with these deconstructed waves that were really similar to Wavy Day. Um, the front of the wig, I feel like Wavy Day had more of a swoop with the bang where this one just comes straight down and it's just one length all the way around. So let's go ahead and look at it.
I think it still has really good movement for it to be a older wig. And when you have that fully hand tied cap, there's just a really natural movement to the hair. Uh, Y'all, it's just something about this fully hand tied caps. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. So, so comfortable. Even though it fits me a little snugger um, than a standard cap like I, you had on Wavy Day, it's still so comfortable. So it is a full mono top, and you have the uh, lace front that goes from the ear tab to the ear tab. The ear tabs are covered with felt, and they have metal stays. There's that fully hand tied cap. Now there's not a lot of stretch in this y'all, um, but it is um, just so comfortable. And then you have the extended nape and the Velcro strap adjusters. And I don't guess I have to tell you what shape this is. So we'll just skip it. No, it is Shaded Biscuit, RL1923SS. Let's move on. So pretty. This is Spotlight by Raquel Welch and Shaded Biscuit. I've not had Spotlight very long, but it quickly became one of my favorites because I think the style is just so pretty. I love the fringe on spotlight the way this fringe just feathers into the body of the style and then you just have these perfectly cut layers it does the same on the other side of the style the uh, part the scalp like feature on spotlight is amazing it really is just really uh, lifelike and uh, realistic and then it is lightweight even though it's a long style it has a lightweight density. It's uh, from the nape, it's about 12 and a half inches. So it is a long style. You will probably have to use some heat on this one uh, up to 300 degrees and keep your wide tooth comb uh, because it does want to, it does tend to tangle a little bit. So let's look at spotlight all the way around. And now the cap. So, uh, for that full monofilament top, we love that because you can part it in any direction. And then you have the temple to temple lace front. And it is on the Memory 2 cap. It has a good amount of stretch. And it has the standard nape on Spotlight and the Velcro strap adjusters. And I'm going to show you, because it has that full mono filament top, that you can change the parting direction on Spotlight. So pretty. Okay, so what you can do is just take your comb, move it over to the side, and you've got more of a side swoop bang. Gives you a little bit more volume on this side. So you can wear it that way too, and then you can switch it over to the other side and wear it uh, on that side as well in the same style. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Heavens to Betsy. <laughs> I saved the best for last, y'all. This is Scene Stiller, and it stills the show. Be prepared for the attention when you wear a Scene Stiller. Remember when I told you that you can have a pair of shoes or a blouse, and you go out and everybody says, your shoes are so pretty, where did you get them? That's what's going to happen when you wear a Scene Stiller. It's going to receive so many compliments. It is stunning. It's one of Raquel Welch's bestsellers. You can absolutely see why. It is just breathtaking. It is long. It has the longest layer. It's 15 inches from the nape. Um, and the fringe here, I mean, 
just look how it feathers. It's gorgeous. Um, I have straightened. I've seen Stiller, so it's not going to look exactly the same as what you would see on the website. So make sure you go check that out. I think this style would be beautiful with some curls or some waves. So much that you could do with it is just breathtaking. So let's take a look at it. And of course, it's Shaded Biscuit. <laughs> It has a full mono top. Let's see if I can get it off. That's a full mono top that's going to allow you to change the direction of your parting. It has a temple to temple lace front, the felt covered ear tabs with metal stays. You have a memory two cap, and it has the standard nape with Velcro strap adjusters. And as I showed you with Spotlight, because you have that mono top, you can change the direction of your parting if you chose to. You could move it to the other side. Now, as with any long style, typically it will tangle some, so you want to keep a wide tooth comb handy and treat it with heat up to 300 degrees to keep the integrity of the fiber. But it's absolutely stunning, y'all. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this. I really did. I love sharing my top five favorite wigs. Um, maybe it'll be different this fall. <laughs> I'll have some brunettes in there for you. <laughs> but thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you again next time.